South Africa has a rich diversity of indigenous plants with potential pharmaceutical and nutritional benefits. While many of these plants are commercially known and currently used to produce herbal remedies, there is considerable scope to add further value to our biological resources and indigenous knowledge through scientific innovation. Chemical engineer Kirsch Naidu plays a significant part in the pursuit of this goal. A chemical engineer at CSR basically is involved in all the steps and processes involved in using chemicals uh, and transforming them into products. Uh, that involves different steps and using different equipment depending on the process that you're trying to develop. I have a lot of projects at CSR. They are actually quite diverse. We do a lot of projects based on aqua feeds, feeds, food development, biopharmaceuticals, medicinal, and also uh, involving the um, development of herbal products in South Africa as well as cosmetics involving also herbal products. The African Ginger Project uh, involves the development of indigenous practices in South Africa involving African ginger and development of the product into uh, various formats that is applicable to humans. Uh, it can be used for many diseases and many ailments and one of the projects I'm involved in is actually optimizing the extraction of the active ingredient from African ginger. Uh, we are currently working on a cough syrup as well as a cream and lotion that uh, uses the extract from the African ginger plant. My advice for young learners is uh, to excel both in physics, maths and science. Uh, if they have a particular interest in physics and maths, then chemical engineering is for them. If they are curious and uh, able uh, to develop products on their own, or have an interest in how um, products are made in South Africa and around the world, then chemical engineering is definitely a field that they should uh, investigate. I enjoy working at CSR because it offers uh, a lot of opportunities to work in multiple diverse fields, as well as expanding my knowledge in the field in various applications. The facilities and laboratories offered, as well as the campus itself, is conducive to a growing environment for a young engineer. If you want to become a chemical engineer, you need to excel both in physical science and mathematics at a matric level. Thereafter, you can apply for entrance into university or technicon to study the field of chemical engineering. And that's basically all you need. Chemical engineers can specialize in many different fields. Uh, some of us start in production environments, working at major petrochemical. Some uh, chemical engineers become consultants and own their own enterprises, uh, leasing their services back to the petrochemical or any other major industry. Uh, some engineers as well become design engineers who basically design pilot plants, etc. And I've also known of some chemical engineers who become lawyers and basically ex their expertise lies in IP and product development and patent law. The work that we do at CSR improves people's lives because it focuses on development of research for application in the field. Uh, for example, with the use of indigenous uh, knowledge, you are able to transform what was previously known in the rural communities into a commercial product that can actually benefit back the traditional holders of the, um, the previous knowledge that is used in the research to formulate a product. The job satisfaction is guaranteed by CSR because uh, knowing that you're doing good and social good uh, is in itself a reward.